All right, so today on this episode of What Plant Is That, Paul, I'm going to talk about the Christmas Carol Aloe. It is a hybrid. There's tons of like Aloe Viper, Aloe Blizzard. They're very similar. Um, this one is going to be really red, um, and they say it will get a foot tall, uh, maybe if it was blooming. Uh, these things stay really small, as you can see. So um, Aloe Christmas Carol, Carol is a hybrid native to South Africa. People are hybridizing them. Uh, they shoot a little red flowers, really, uh, maybe gets a foot tall, like, the, like I said. Um, and it does really well. Um, I have some in soil. I have some in a uh, succulent fountain. I have them in this uh, amazing pot here by, uh, you can check her out, Smashly Art. Uh, on Instagram. She's awesome. This is uh, one of, uh, this is of course, you know who this is, I hope, um, from the Red Hot Chili Peppers. And I also have Flea as well. Um, super cool. Uh, but anyways, um, you can check her out on Instagram. We'll put a link. Uh, Scott will do that because he's rad. Anyways, um, I love this plant and I love this pot. Uh, it will shoot out little small pieces um, or little offspring, I guess you could say. And the red is, is, is stunning. It's not um, sharp, the, the thorns are relatively mild, and again, it will kind of just cluster around. I have some bigger samples, but I just wanted to show you this one because I think the pot is so cool. Um, and uh, it's, it, it's got a bit of frost damage, I will show you, like we got some colder weather, and you can see a little bit of frost damage there. Nothing too, mi uh, it's relatively minor, and it will bloom, I'd say in the next month or two, probably like, uh, if I recall, I want to say August. Um, I can't remember though. But if you leave the bloom, it will come out. The flower will bloom, and then actually, if you leave it, I've seen little babies on the actual expended flower. It's really cool. Um, again, this is Aloe Christmas Carol. It's a beautiful little hybrid, and it does well in Southern California. Hardy to 25 degrees, and it will produce offspring and it grows pretty quickly. Um, again, it can survive in native soil, um, in the ground, or does well, obviously, as a potted plant. So give us a like and a subscribe, and we'll keep them coming. We've got plenty more videos coming your way. All right, have a great day. Bam.